Be sure to refresh this channel multiple times each day for the hottest and latest WWE news and rumors. Like and subscribe. After a devastating loss at WWE Money in the Bank and 10 years of being used and abused, it has finally happened. The trepidation. WWE superstars, according to Ringside News, go through a lot of stress. A decade as a WWE superstar can cause some real havoc on your brain too. Tamina Snook underwent this and understands this all too well. Tamina lost, lost at Money in the Bank. Then she disappeared, but she has now resurfaced, and she's in a mental institution. She has been taken. She has been, well, is this the right thing to do? I mean, is she really of that mental capacity? Her being admitted to a mental facility? Remember to share, subscribe, and smash the bell. Turn on all notifications, ladies and gentlemen. Tamina Snook is now doing videos on her own, but you never know how WWE might use her or one of her viral creations. This is certainly in the running for one of the most interesting promos we've seen in a long time. She had a lot of very strange things to say in the video, including that she hasn't felt better. This was an interesting thing coming from someone in a straitjacket from a mental hospital. So ladies and gentlemen, um, your comments and your opinions on something that is very different not something I thought I was going to be reporting on, but that's exactly what we're here to do. Your comments, your opinion, share, to su share, subscribe, smash that bell. And what do you think about this new mental hospital situation with Tamina Snuka? Can she battle it, her demons? Will she get out of it? Is it part of a story? Is it real? Your comments, your opinions, more to come from the Brash and Brazen, where I keep it prolific, consistent, and dedicated. Later.